I'm John Paul Ito, and in this video, I'm going to present one of the examples from my book, Focal Impulse Theory, Musical Expression, Meter, and the Body. There are a few things going on in this passage from a Mozart piano sonata that we'll hear in a moment. The music's in 2-4, and we're going to feel those quarter note beats as if they're interacting with gravity, a lot like a conducting pattern in two. So those notated upbeats are all going to gather tension. They're going to feel like they're moving upwards, pulling against gravity. And the notated downbeats are all going to release that tension as if moving downwards. So I'm going to show that in this hand, conducting the beats and the meter, but especially to show the release of tension, the gathering of tension. Now the next element is that Mozart plays with meter in this passage. So some of the time when we hear a downbeat, it's an actual notated downbeat. But some of the time he's shifted it. So what we hear as a downbeat is actually taking place in the middle of the measure on the upbeat. Now these things interact because this flow of release and gathering of tension just goes with the notated meter very uniformly. Some of the time those heard downbeats are going to be notated downbeats and so they'll sound like they're releasing. But some of the time when Mozart's shifted that heard downbeat to the middle of the measure, that heard downbeat will therefore sound like it's pulling, like it's gathering tension. Now the next element in here, the final element, is phrase rhythm. So we can understand this music very easily according to four bar phrase patterns, and I'm going to show that in this hand. I'm going to conduct in four. Each downbeat is going to be a beat in my pattern in four to show that four bar phrase rhythm. But I'm not conducting the notated downbeats necessarily. I'm conducting the heard downbeats. And that means that as Mozart plays with the meter, as he stretches and compresses those measures, my beats are going to speed up and slow down. So you'll see that. You'll see the rate of those measures, and you'll see how it fits in with that four bar phrase pattern. So a few things going on in my conducting. This hand showing the meter and the beat, the releasing and gathering of tension. This hand showing where those heard downbeats are and how they interact with that four bar phrase pattern. Now as you watch and listen to the performance as I conduct, as David Keep plays the piano, I hope you're going to be aware that the conducting is not just showing you kind of a mental interpretation that I'm asking you to superimpose on the music. Rather, this performance is being shaped according to this understanding of the music. 